Hello everyone, it's me again, GW fan the softcore brony. Welcome you back to Let's Play Philly Fantasy 6. I've slightly rearranged the party to include red er the equipment of the party <laughs> to include the red chaperons because there are some enemies that can use fire upcoming and I don't particularly need like complete uh protection. There are also new enemies over here. And this. Hi ya. Okay, Luna, how's about we use some new Alicorn powers here? Because we are gonna need the, well, HP and defense. From the old Lunar Ara. Little tiny bit of healing. Boosted by the Hero Ring, of course. These guys will actually occasionally heal you when you kill them. Uh. Yeah, let's do it again. Yeah, they'll heal you sometimes when they you kill them. I don't know why. Thank you! But yeah, those no rabbits, I suppose I should note them, because in the original game, if Gao or Pinky for that matter, uh, attacked them, or not attacked them, they uh, copied them, they would uh, get Cure 2. But in this mod, they give you Cure 3, which, well, it's nice, it's there. Hmm. Yeah, I'll have to heal the next battle. Yeah, I love Lunar Aura. It keeps you nice and healthy, gives you extra defense. You know, it works in a lot of situations there, which is nice. I don't think there's any other enemies in the desert, in the forest, is there? Anyway, if we walk around this way, we can get to a very large desert. There's nothing out there right now. The enemies there are all weak to ice and, well, water, if you have that somehow, but... Otherwise, we're going into this place. Uh, Trixie? What are you doing here? Come back here! Where'd you go? Anyway, this place should look familiar. Now that it's the World of Ruin, the treasures here have changed once again. Except for the one over that way. I've already uh, picked up that treasure. Here we get uh, three of the four new enemies that are around here. The Humpties are those guys in the front there. I can easily kill them, ouch, with Grasp. That right there was the reason I wanted uh, Fire Elemental Protection, because that guy up in the top uh, left there, the Cruller, 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 aw. Oh. Well, that didn't go well. Yeah, he does that, which is nasty. Heal us, Luna. I, I would actually like the extra defense there. One nice thing about the peace ring that I have is that it also protects against confusion, which the Mad Gryphon there can inflict on us. Yeah, otherwise, this guy actually has really high evasion. So I'm gonna have Caden go after him. And everything here with the Mad Gryphon, or at least among the enemies that work that are in this battle anyway, are weak to fire. Uh, the Cruller also can be killed with Rasp, but Cadence doesn't quite have enough power to kill it like that without doing it at least twice. Hmm, that didn't look right. No, it did not. Well, I seem to be having trouble with that. <laughs> Dang it. I usually don't, but apparently today's just not the day. Ow. It'd be nice to get a little bit of health back, because the enemies here are just annoying like that. Anyway, most of the enemies in actually, uh, yeah, three, uh, bleh. <laughs> a lot of the enemies in here are also undead, or at least the cooler and the Humpty are. So don't try to absorb anything from them with uh, Osmos. Not a good idea. In fact, I don't think the Mad Griffin counts as... Uh, undead, though, so you could get it from him. He's weak to poison, otherwise. Oh, the enemies here are otherwise weak to holy as well, so you could use that against them. Well, not the Mad Gryphon, but... But yeah, I've already, uh... gotten that one right there. Yeah, let's get a little bit of extra healing in there. Because I might need it, <laughs> depending on what happens here. 
I can get this one. So, and we get the Manta Roar. He's weak to poison. He's also susceptible to dying. If I can find it, where's the death spell? Where is the death spell? There's the death spell. Ow. Well, that's not gonna matter. He's dead. Yeah, I just, I would rather do that, because it would take a couple, well, it would take, like, three strikes to get him between Cadence and, uh, Moon Launch. So, that's all the new enemies around here. That guy also can be killed with Ras, but Cadence just doesn't have one enough power to do so. Alright, I can go at least one more battle. Get a Cider Jug, which I think we already have at least one. Don't we? Oh, no, we don't. Okay, never mind. Yeah, fully recovers MP. Awesome. So, put that uh, where I'll, well, practically never use it. <laughs> Honestly. Which I must do immediately, and let's switch those around. Yeah, so that antidote's in a nice, convenient spot. One more new treasure around here that I've well, been waiting patiently for. I love Lunar Aura. I can keep my HP all the way up fairly easily that way. <laughs> anyway, over here in this chest, we get the Hero Ring. Our second one of the game. Very nice. Otherwise, well, it wouldn't be there if you collected it earlier in the game. So, there... Wow, we got a peace ring. That's like a rare drop from, I think, is it the, yeah, I think the Mad Griffins is like 12.5% drop from them. <laughs> That's interesting. Anyway, yeah, Caden's got to level up, so I got my extra bit of magic there. Nice. Might as well finish that off, even though she's going to learn haste at the next level. And you are actually really close to learning. All right, I am going to get stopped just in time. Nice. And I can go at least one more battle. So, oh, I already went that way. Now, unfortunately, the healing pond does not heal anymore. But that's because now there's a little bit of a different thing we can do here. <laughs> Diamond dogs are friends to turtles. Who knew? around the pond. Even though that door was already there the first time we came here, so it's not like they actually dug that. Trixie? Again? Hey! And press A, and up at the same time to jump across. That's why we can't use the healing anymore. Anyway, this room also has same enemies. Lunar Aura keeps me healthy, and between the Mad Griffins and the Manta Roars, which I've still only met the one. <laughs> I can keep uh, Cadence's MP up. Hey, Trixie! Amulet? What? Now, in the original game, well, that would have been Siegfried, and you don't actually have to see that. That doesn't, well, have any bearing on this game either. <laughs> either one of these, but that would have more or less been the last time you saw him. I mean, there is technically another point where you see him again. Alright, that works as well, I suppose, if you, you don't really want to do it that way. <laughs> you know, if you don't want to use grass a whole bunch of time. Bam! So, awesome. Apple Critters. I didn't quite get enough to get Luna's level up there, but... Yeah, what I was saying about Siegfried, it's like there's like... It's kind of like there's two Siegfrieds. <laughs> The way they game does it. Now, this seems like a dead end, but just go down this way. But, uh, yeah, this mod, it's a little different with Trixie. Who's, you know, we've already seen in at least one spot where she normally wouldn't have appeared in the original. Uh oh. Now, here in the castle, we, yet again, have the same enemies to face. And these guys are hungry, because they've been down here for who knows how long. And we're, well, somewhere we can't get out, so we have no choice but to go this way. And yeah, they're all still hungry. 
Oh, actually, it's down here. This is where the enemies are. They're not up in the upper castle. So, let's see. Come around this way. I'm literally right there to getting <laughs> freaking stop. I had to stop to get, uh, a, well, since I just got to level up to get uh, Masquerade and all that, but still. Sheesh. Anyway. Here we get the Rising Sun and a golden bit. Uh, Rising Sun, this has the same stat boost as the Aurora Ring, so I don't need to give that to Luna. I'm going to give it to uh, Cadence instead. It's a little stronger than the Aurora Ring, as you can see there. So that'll do us well. It also gives your stats a little bit there. And, oh yeah, I got that golden bit. Oh, actually, this, no, no one in this party can even equip that. That's for the uh, light armor characters. See, Cider Mug. Awesome. Zap Apple. Great. Coming up this way first. I'd like to get into a battle so I can finish off. Stop! Apparently, that's not going to happen, though. This treasure, we get the, uh, well, not quite almighty, but the <laughs> Regal Crown. This is a... Our first piece of uh, Alicorn armor, finally, which is actually not that great. <laughs> That's kind of low defenses for an ultimate armor, but it does have some, well, actually kind of low-key stat boost compared to some of the other ultimate armors. But yeah, this more or less is the best helmet for these two, but since there are still some enemies around that use fire, I don't want to equip this just yet, even though it is, does have some good stats to it, oh, except for its magic block, but yeah, I do like the stat boost, that's kind of the best trait, really. Yeah, though it otherwise has rather mediocre stats, unlike in Pony Fantasy, which tried to improve it. Finally! Stop! Anyway, what was I saying about what, whatever it was I was saying? <laughs> Uh, anyhow, I don't care about gravity and wave. Is there anything else whatsoever I care to give you? Not particularly. I oh, I don't have. I still haven't given you the life spell. Where is? Oh, I thought. Oh, there's life. Yeah, let's do that. That's silly that you don't have the life spell yet. <laughs> I'm kind of surprised by that. I could kind of use scan. Eh, to these. Anyhow. The rest of this place is pretty straightforward. Just go up this way. Anyway. Oh, there you. What the hey? Uh, let me re equip the party real quick, and I'll be right back. Alrighty. I have re-equipped the party like this with the uh, hero rings and speed shoes specifically because, uh, well, the next enemy we're going to fight has, well, a unique ability that uh, auto haste will make you immune to. So otherwise, I've, well, got all the usual stuff for the most part. I've got given the regal crown to Cadence because I, eh, I feel it's stat boost effect. Well, benefit her a little bit better than Luna for the time being, so. I've also topped off uh, Cadence's MP, as you can see, <laughs> with uh, some of the other uh, cider cups that I've got. So, anyway, talking to uh, Solaris. Uh, you've got some pretty interesting contraptions underneath the castle here. I mean, we use magic to move around. What are these things for? Oh, a room back there, huh? <laughs> I kind of like how they're sort of like in the middle of her... Well, at the end of her... What she says there. And you can only tell because of the quotations. <laughs> Go! Kate... Er... Celestia! <laughs> Give me a hoof! Help me recapture my... I mean, help me with these creatures that snuck into the castle somehow. <laughs> we knew it was you all along. And this battle is... Kind of complicated, if not actually... If not really difficult. <laughs> Otherwise. But, uh... Who the heck came up with this? 
Anyway, Luna, Medley, immediately. Celestia, I did teach you slow at some point. Do it on this guy up here. And Cadence, cast the old death spell on the bottom left. As that will actually work against this guy. <laughs> These guys can do actually a variety of spells, but the two on the right are affected by Mute, which is why I just did that. <laughs> I cast Medley, which uses Mute and Sleep. See, Luna, I want you to use Luna R now to protect us, because that guy can still use that. Unfortunately, I didn't get that off in time. <sighs> uh, let's cure that. Okay, one more thing I want you to do there, Luna, and I want you to cast Powder, because that guy's awake now. See, don't do it on... Ow. Just got slow now. Dang it! Uh, okay, fine. Cast Stop on this guy. He's the only one that's affected by Stop. And since he has Slow, it'll actually work a little bit longer than normal. Yeah, that's... that's... That thing they just did to, to Celeste right there, we are immune to that. I don't think I can actually get yeah, her like that, so... Oh. Yes, kill you up since your turn kind of is forfeit now. And... Yeah, otherwise... Okay, you have stop, so... Yeah, let's hit them with stop, because... One of them is actually, I believe it, or no, did I kill the one that absorbs fire? I might have. Anyway, I want to use Ice 2 on the one down here in the corner. Yeah, everything, it should have popped up already long ago, what these guys are all weak to. You keep on casting slow on these guys, because they are all affected by it. While well, Luna keeps doing stuff. So you should be able to kill that one now. In fact, I should have kept recast stop on that guy and on that other guy, but oh well. <laughs> Looks like she's just gonna kill it outright anyway. And you're good there, so hang out for a minute, keep us healthy if need be. And yeah, I'm gonna recast stop on you. In fact, how about you have ice too? Help us out there. Cadence. That's Osmos something. Uh we're yeah, let's get the guy that actually has nasty MP. And actually no, let's keep on going with Pummel. The other one's not that strong. These two guys, these last two do not have any specific weaknesses. So yeah, just fire two, that's the lowest cost. Wow, you just keep getting on the same guy there. That went enormously uh, better than I was expecting, so let's gust. And Yeah, let's do that instead. Well, you heal yourself. Sure. Should kill that guy. Maybe. Maybe not. Oh, dead. Good. Actually, I think... Is this one affected by the poison status? I think this one might be affected by the poison status, but... Yeah, go ahead and use gas. That's basically the strongest thing you can do. Obviously, I can't... Uh, <laughs> I don't think I can use launch, but there's no reason to try now. Alrighty, and that's... Well, this guy, he's muted, so he can't do much of anything to me. So, yeah, this fight's basically over. After they... Oh, almost sees Celestia once more. Uh, that should do it. There we go. Who the heck came up with this fight? What the heck? Oh, by the way, Celestia was equipped with... Was just auto-equipped. Like, as if she had, like, the best stuff and all that. But I could have changed her weapon and shield, but... Eh, whatever. That fight, while kind of crazy, is not so bad, so... Yeah, what's up with that? Uh... Well, I guess. <laughs> I I became this uh well, I don't know I don't know how she got their I don't know attention in the first place, but maybe it was the wild hair. <laughs> Seriously. At first, fortunately, they're dumb.
anyway. Oh, hi! Hey. Well, so much for that. <laughs> Says you, that thing was weird. Are we just gonna let them, yeah, go? Well, I suppose. Teleporter Matrix. <laughs> so you use machinery to, to cast magic, huh? That's interesting. And with Luna in the party, she does get at least one unique thing to say. And Celestia must uh, be in your party. Well, she must be recruited, but uh, yeah, they've taken all these treasures. As far as I'm aware, we don't ever get to see them again, but in here we do get the Horn Saber, which is a sword that, well, steals MP, as long as you actually don't have any. Yeah, it does have a little bit of a magic boost there, which is kind of nice, but I don't really intend to use it. It does also teach Osmos, so if no one has it yet, that you, you know, absolutely needs it. There you go. Uh, yeah, I don't particularly need that. Well, <laughs> kind of. Now, anyway, there are still random encounter monsters, at least in this room. There's actually one unique to this room that I think is called, like, the Drop. But, yeah, just run from these guys for the moment. I'm not ready for this right now. But, yeah, I think they're, yeah, they're called the, I think it was the Drop. I forgot I need to kind of, like, re-equip the party and all that. <laughs> Got that Aurora Ring and everything. Boost the old magic power, which is still higher than yours by a long shot, thanks to all that equipment you got. I don't think there's random encounters in any other room, but yeah, the drop isn't a, a particularly interesting enemy as far as I'm concerned. I don't... Oh, there are still fights here. Oh, well, I guess I should, uh, like, heal up or something. You guys are all weak to fire. I need my health, or my MP back. Ow! I need a lot of things back. Ah. So, yeah, I'm going to get out of here, and we'll continue on with the quest next time on Let's Play Philly Fantasy VI. You also need Osmos. You have enough MP left? Uh, Arrivederci!